Hello, I'm Sheila Gilbert, National President of the Society of St. Vincent de Paul. I want to spend a few minutes to share with you my vision for the Society. That vision is end poverty through systemic change. Why this vision? Because I don't believe that God looks at any child and says, you will have no future. You will live and struggle all your life and never achieve your dreams. You will die feeling that you failed. But if that is not God's will, why is that the reality we see so often around us? Poverty is created and maintained by choices. Choices made by individuals, by institutions, by communities, and by our nation. The good news is that by making different choices, we can create the decent and happy life for all people for which we constantly pray. How will we go about helping those we serve, our communities, and our country to make new choices, to think and act in ways that create prosperity for all? I believe the answer lies in systemic change. By first changing our own attitudes, then changing the way we relate to those whom we serve, and finally, working in our local communities and at the national level to change the systems and the policies which keep so many in poverty. Change is never easy. Each of us as Vincentians works long and hard to bring relief to those who suffer, to meet their most pressing needs, to help them survive another day. The help we give is valuable. In fact, sometimes it is all that stands between an individual and complete despair. And we know that the need is growing, growing to the point where we and our resources are strained to the limit. We also realize that as important as that help is, it is only a band-aid, a temporary fix and not a solution. We and the people we serve must move beyond survive to thrive, to see every person we serve as a fountain of potential and a store of assets which can be tapped for themselves and their communities. It is time to commit ourselves to walk the journey out of poverty with those we serve. It is time to move beyond just our own work in our own way, to involvement in our communities, with others who share the, our concern for the dignity of all life and want to see meaningful opportunity for all. It is time for new approaches, new attitudes, and new actions. I believe that divine providence is guiding this vision. With faith in God, we can walk into a future that is brighter. As Vincentians, we serve in hope, a hope that is based on faith in God to do what we cannot do alone. I invite each of you to commit your counsel, your conference, and yourselves to walk the journey out of poverty with and for those we serve. Our next step in this journey is to update the Society's strategic plan for the next five years. That plan will focus on ending poverty through systemic change. It will outline new and different objectives for the Society and for each Vincentian. Together, united in prayer and action, we can make this vision a reality. May God continue to bless your work and your lives.